Well, the Northwest Arkansas Farm and Ranch Expo is coming up this week. We've got Dale Daniels with us this morning to talk about this event. Good morning. Thanks for waking up early Good to morning, be Caitlin. here. Good morning, Thank you for having me. Uh, Dale, for people who are looking to maybe attend this event, mm -hmm. uh, tell me a little bit about what people can expect to do and see. Well, Caitlin, it starts tomorrow at 9 o'clock mm -hmm. at the Washington County Fairgrounds, and we've got about 70 vendors out there, uh, trucks, tractors, everything in between. Uh, a lot of people don't realize how big a deal farming is up here. You see all yeah. the growth. You don't realize there are 2,100 farms in Benton County wow. alone and almost that many in Washington County. Mm -hmm. So farming is a big deal and what this is, it just celebrates everything farming and agriculture. Uh, we've got a lot going on. Tomorrow afternoon we've got a couple of concerts. We've got Colt Barber who's a rising young star out okay. of Nashville. He actually opened for Little Texas at the Great Festival last month and just uh -huh. tore it up. So if you saw a that, you want to come back. A, a fan favorite. A local fan favorite, backed by popular demand. And then at uh, 7 o'clock, the Neelands are going to perform. The Neelands are a great gospel group, members of the mm -hmm. Gospel Music Hall of Fame, family group, and they do a phenomenal job. Uh, IDK Cafe is going to be doing catfish dinners. So okay. encourage people to come out for that. And it's a free admission, free parking, and just encourage everybody to come out. Now, this is the first year for this event in Northwest Arkansas. Mm -hmm. Why bring it to up here, to this area? Well, we're putting it on Nash Icon 94.3's station behind it in Fort Smith, Big Country 107.3. We'd done it down there a couple of years. Uh -huh. And it was so successful, we thought, well, why not bring it up here to Northwest Arkansas? And we did. The response has been really strong on it. So uh, we're looking forward to it being a big success up here as well. What is the importance of having events like this in our community? I know that farming is huge in mm -hmm. our community. So why bring people out to an event like this? I think just to have one for the farmers to see what's going on. Mm -hmm. So whether you're farming a thousand acres or ten acres on the weekend, there's something there for them. Uh, right. And also just to have people to have an understanding of how important farming is. You know, Caitlin, when you get down to it, if you eat it or wear it, it probably started on a farm somewhere. Mm -hmm. So uh, we're all connected to farming whether yeah. we realize it or not. Very cool. So if people at home are looking to come out to this event, when and where is it taking place? Again, starts tomorrow. For, okay. uh, goes from 9 to 5. It's at the Washington County Fairground. And then Saturday, 9 to 4, you'll be wrapped up in time to watch the Hogs beat Colorado State. Oh, yes. Go Hogs. I go. like the spirit there. Dale, thank you so much for joining thank us. You, for more, we'll have more information about this on our website. That's fox24news.tv.